Hi there guys, it's Jakko here. I'd like to show you something I came across in 3D Code last spring when I was working with this gun model. It's for a game and I need to do some retopo to this, so I chose 3D Code as my weapon of choice for the retopo re and yes, it came out pretty well. But I had this barrel area and I wanted to do this really precisely and I wanted to use uh, actually other application Lightwave to do this. I ended up just doing this in Lightwave and then importing it into 3D Code and going from there. But I had this strange issue that whenever I have like uh, this barrel guy in here and then the others, the other ones, I can't really do anything to this barrel. It appears and I can see the polygons but I can't do UV maps or anything. It seems like it's locked out. It's uh, sort of out of my reach somehow. And I was like scratching my head around this like what am I missing? Like I have every retop object in here selected and I can select all faces and nothing really works. It's like it's there, but it's not really there. So what's going on? So I poke around in the forums a little bit and I got really nice feedback. The 3D code forums are actually a brilliant place to get advice and help. So I really recommend to check them out. So the guys told me this. The read topology in 3D code is based on UV maps. So, so if you have one UV map, uh, it's sort of everything what you do in there is kind of locked in that UV map. So then that made me think, wait, so maybe I kind of have two UV maps in here and that's what happened. So I have this, we have this UV set selection here and you look at this, we got two default. One is with the big D and one is with small D. So, so this is the one, the barrel, which I did in Lightwave and it's the same name, but just a little difference. And then we have this other part. So this is what happened. I've got two UVs, so it's really easy to fix. So what I did was that I just selected this and sort of selected all phases in here. And click this move, select it to default. And now everything is in the same UV set and we are completely ready to go here. We have no problems whatsoever. Now we are in full control. So even if you have multiple retopo objects, you can still like use this so that, uh, you know, you can use multiple objects in here in order to kind of, uh, if you have a complicated model with a lot of uh, different parts, then you can sort of arrange them in here really nicely and, and this will work. So my word of advice is that make sure that your all your objects are in the same UV set. So if you import uh, assets from other 3D modeling applications to 3D code, make sure that that either they don't have UVs or that uh, basically that the UV uh, set is the same set with exactly the same name as the one in 3D code. So this is just a little advice about Retopo and the UVs. So this was Jakko, I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you soon. Bye bye.